In this section, I will introduce you the concept of testing and training data. So it is very important to be familiar with this concept. Often in data mining, the data is split into two subsets, training data and testing data. Training data is used to construct a model and the testing data set is used to evaluate that model. So in all the coming examples that we will discuss, we will use this testing and training subsets. So let us first discuss how this is done in Rapid Miner. It is very simple. We will start off with taking a repository, balance scale data set. Here we go. Drag and drop your data set. Now the operator that is used for testing and training is the cross validation operator. You can simply find it in the operators window. Right cross validation here we go this is the cross validation operator just drag it and drop it in the main process window if you have any confusion about how this process is done you can simply click on this validation operator and see the help window which provides a lot of help about how this operator works next step let us this cross validation operator is a nested operator this blue sign this blue double box is at the bottom of this operator shows that this is a nested operator it is further divided into sub processes let us double click on that and here are these two processes testing uh, testing and training now in training you have to apply any algorithm that you want to apply on your data sets in this case let us consider the default model again here we go drag and drop and in the testing you have to apply the model and evaluate its performance so number one you will have to apply a model apply model here you go drag and drop and the other thing is a performance operator that will evaluate the performance of the model performance this is the performance operator drag it and drop it. Now just connect the ports. Simple. So we're done with this testing and training sub processes. Now let us connect the ports at the previous level. To go to the previous level, click this up button and you will go to the out outside this nested process this is the main window now we will connect the ports over here connect the repository and connect the outputs of this validation process there can be multiple outputs this cross validation will give three outputs one will be the evaluation of the model one will be the model first of all the model that will be created secondly the evaluation of that model and thirdly the same example data set will be shown so now we'll click the play button or the run button here we go simple so this is the performance of the model created in the rightmost tab we have this default model and this is the example set again so this is how cross validation is performed in rapid miner to review it in very shortly just drag and drop your data set from the repository select the cross validation operator go into its nested processes apply any model that you want in the training model it can be KNN it can be knife base it can be decision tree anything you want that will be applied in the training section in the testing section you will apply the model and then the performance will be measured through a performance operator so that is how testing and training data are separated in rapid miner